Alrighty, uh, hello everybody. Um, I wanted to put together a quick video on the setup process for um, the particle accelerator in the Stone Block 4 Feed the Beast mod pack. Um, I had a bunch of trouble trying to figure out uh, the best way to set one of these up. Um, and through research, a bunch of Reddit threads, a couple of YouTube videos, I was able to find something that worked for me um, and I thought was pretty compact and efficient. Um, so just getting right into it, we have our particle accelerators, one on each side, um, connected to our guide rings and our linear motors, which um, are what make up the actual ring. Um, the linear motors are going to need power, and the accelerator magnetic field in the center is also going to need power. This piece uh, is going to consume a lot of power. Um, to sort of solve that, we have these add-on extenders um, connected directly to the sides of it. Um, and on those add-on extenders, we have our efficiency add-ons, um, or efficiency and capacitor add-ons to give it some more juice. Um, so underneath these, you know, we have our, our, our universal cable. Um, just, you know, make sure that you have a, a, a stable enough power source to actually give the, this thing the juice it needs. Otherwise, you're going to have particles escaping. Um, so beyond that, um, we have this speed sensor, which is connected to a standard vanilla dropper, um, connected to a chest and a uh, Oritech item pipe that's going to feed um, our fluxite in this case, um, which uh, is what I'm using to make plutonium. Um, to actually set it up, you're going to need the advanced target designator. Um, so you will shift right click your particle accelerator and connect it to your magnetic field. And then shift right click the particle accelerator and then shift right click the speed sensor to actually connect it. And then once you have all that set up, um, you can actually start the process. So we'll take some uranium dust, put it inside of the particle accelerator. And then once this thing gets up to speed, this is going to put off a redstone signal to drop a single piece of fluxite into our particle accelerator. And then over here, you'll find your plutonium dust. You can run a couple of these things at a time as well. Um, but just keep in mind, you're going to need to have enough power to actually keep the accelerator magnetic field uh, online. Um, you can see it starts eating through a lot of power. But so long as you have enough of it, um, it'll actually keep going. Perfect. Alrighty. Thanks for watching.